You ready? You look ready. Hastings left Salt Lake City. We tracked his movements all the way to Cuba. We have to assume Perseus moved the nuke there. Langley believes Castro could help Perseus smuggle it into the U.S. in exchange for a peek at the hardware, of course. That isn't gonna happen. What's the plan? The last read we have on Hastings came from 30 miles south of Havana. We suspect Perseus is using an abandoned compound there to hold the nuke. They're working under the radar, so expect moderate security. I say we smash and grab. Parachute in, grab the nuke, skyhook out. And what if the nuke isn't there? It's there. The only reason Perseus needs Hastings in Cuba is to prepare it for arming and detonation. There you have it. Hudson will arrange our exfil while we're en route. If everyone's ready, let's move out. Adler's late. No, love. We're early. Adler should be checking in right about... Park, we're in position. Copy that. We're moving to flank. All teams, we do this fast and loud. Find Hastings, grab the nuke, get the hell out. Woods, light up this joint. About fucking time. Go, go, go! Do the honors, Bill. Moving up. That's like fucking clockwork. Our team span out. Defense to the main gate. Check. Oh, my God. 
they've got closed circuit Battle. cameras. Fine, we could use them two. to locate the nuclear bomb. Sharp as ever. Shop. Contact. Fuck! Is everyone all right? Bell, sweep for mines. Say we finally grab that drink when this is over. Your persistence is admirable, Lazar. <laughs> That's not a no. Jesus, get a fucking room, you two. one behind the counter. Thanks, Park. Keep looking. There. Hold it. Adler, we have eyes on the nuclear device. Bloody hell. Someone's killing the scientists. Where? Second floor, room 27B. Second floor, center room. Upstairs, let's move. Keep you there, Park. Crude, but effective. Can't keep your eyes off me, huh, Park? Bell, use the C4. Adler, we're moving to the second floor. We're pinned down. Move ahead. We'll catch up. Fire! Need a 
Finding cover. Please, Move they're it. shooting at us. No, <laughs> stay away. <laughs> Bell canvas the room. Hastings, stop talking. <laughs> Perseus was here. <coughs> he shot us. Uh, escaped. Perseus would never leave his precious nuke behind. He forced us to reverse engineer the detonation codes. They give him full access to green light. What? Are you telling me Perseus can detonate multiple nukes in Europe? I'm so sorry. Hastings, stay with us. How many green light devices can Perseus detonate with those codes? He can detonate all of them. He'll wipe out half of Europe. Blame it all on the USA. We need to find that son of a bitch, Perseus. Time to go, no? Contact! Chopper coming in low. It's gotta be Perseus. All teams head to the roof. Move! Move! Adler, we got a shit ton of reinforcements circling this compound. Doors clear out of the way. Adler, I got eyes on an HVT south rooftop. Could be Perseus. He's climbing into a chopper. Lock it down. Out the window. Out the window. Bell, let's go. Horse piss you call beer. Fuego de supresión. Proper drunk. Get ready. Here they come.
getting low on Where's that plane? One minute. Stay focused, Jessup. I'll tell you what. When we get out of this, I'm by. Now that's something worth fighting for. Ground team, this is Skyhook. Your zone is hot as hell. We lend an assist. I hope he'd much appreciate it, Skyhook. Roger that. Help is on the way. Clearing the roof now. Good effect, good effect. First, we'll cover. Go. We don't have much time. Get moving, Take cover. Shit. Go in with the intel you have, not the intel you want. We paid the fucking piper down there. You think this is Bell's fault? I don't know whose fault it is. I just know that Perseus doesn't have a single fucking nuke. He's got dozens. Millions of people are gonna die, and the United States will take the blame. You need to find out where he's planning to broadcast the activation signal. How are we gonna pull that out of our ass? Bell knows where it is. Bell? This goddamn science project was a failure! Don't count Adler out yet. The man has a deep bag of tricks. Come on, a little further. Sims, get the gurney. Looks like you were one of the lucky ones out there. Well, we're not gonna lose these two for nothing. Going for broke here, Bell. Putting all our chips on the table. You need to stay on point for this. Sharp. Focused. Sims, get the dosages ready. All of them. Adler, stop wasting our valuable time. He's of no use to us anymore. Stay alert, Bell. You're the key to stopping persons. No more half-assing it. We're doing an intracerebral injection. Damn. Do the eye socket. You sure about this, Doc? face with Perseus in Vietnam. EKG is spiking. 
Shit. Heart rate's off the charts. I need you to relax and focus, Bell. Your helicopter crashed. You made your way through the jungle, alone. You found a bunker. Do you remember the bunker, Bell? We need to know what's inside that bunker. Do not trust Adler. Adler is lying to you. Do not trust him. Do not listen to Adler. He is lying to you. He is lying to you. Do not trust Adler. During a mission to investigate reports of a Soviet bunker, your chopper was hit by ground fire. According to your debrief, you woke up in the middle of a firefight. The crash survivors were defending against a VC attack. You ran forward and picked up an M16. Or maybe it was another one. fled into the tree line. It was then you realized you were the sole survivor. You set off to locate the bunker. The path split near a ruin, so he took the right fork, not the trail to the left. Latrines for a month. Come back here. I'm not done talking to you. You heard Russian voices from a cave across the river, so you went to investigate. 
Bell, I need you to turn around and go into the cave. You equipped your shotgun and had a bow with you. That's when you discovered VC soldiers meeting with Soviet agents. Yes, Bell. That was the door into the Soviet bunker. Yes, good, the bunker. Now tell me about Perseus. Ah, we almost had it. Let's run six. Ready. Bell. We've got a job to do. According to your debrief, you woke up and the rest of your crew was missing. The VC were on the ground searching for survivors. You readied your bow to take them out silently.
path split near a ruin, so you took the well-traveled trail on your left, not toward the waterfall on the right. You mentioned crossing a bridge near a village. I thought there was somewhere on the other side. At the fork, you followed the road right toward the sound of gunfire. Seeing a firefight, you readied your M16. He stirred up a hornet's nest. You need chopper support ASAP. Firefight and ready to turn 16. Command, we stirred up the hornet's nest. Get chopper support ASAP. Roger that. Chopper inbound. ETA 2 minutes. Yes, this was the bunker entrance you described in the report. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe our doses is too high.
Don't stop, Bell. Fuck, fuck! Hand me the fallback scenario manual. Here. Bell, we've got a job to do. According to your debrief, you woke up in the middle of a fire. Crash survivors were defending against a VC attack. You readied a grenade launcher and charged ahead. path split near a ruin, so you took the well-traveled trail on your left, not toward the waterfall on the right. Reports at the bunker across the bridge. Allies were pinned down on a ridge. You readied your sniper rifle to assist. Inside the house hit by Napalm, you find a hidden bunker door. Go check it out, Bell! I don't care if the door was fucking stuck, open it! Give Bell another injection. Do it, now! 
Bell's heart rate is already at a dangerous. This is some fucked up shit. Someone help me hold Bell down. doing in the lab. Bell, forget about the damn lab. I need to know about the bunker. Comrades, the United States and its allies slowly consume that which is survive another round. I have no idea. Do it. We're not leaving empty-handed. Script 17. Ready. Bell, we've got a job to do. We've been over this already. Skip ahead to the next part. The bunker door was right there at the ruins, Bell. You went in. Bell, go into the bunker now. States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. Our leaders continue to weaken under this threat. It is the moral duty of Perseus to act when they will not. Soon we will possess an American nuclear bomb. The key to unlocking their entire green light arsenal. Once we control the green light arsenal, we will detonate them all from the safety of Solovetsky. You gotta admit, I'm surprised. I didn't think they'd recover so fast. We tried everything. Normal forms of interrogation won't work. Breaking a subject's will and erasing their mind is a difficult and painful process. The 
that's a small price to pay. The CIA's mind control program has had a great deal of success with implanted memories. You want me to tell them about my time in Vietnam? Lastly, you'll need a command phrase to trigger the implanted memories. We have a job to do. We have a job to do. We have a job to do. You had to reach the Soviet bunker. It appears the subject's programming is beginning to take hold. We've got a job to do. We've known each other for years. Fought together, bled together, been through the hell of Vietnam together. We got a job to do. And now the training is complete. We just need to give the subject a name. Bell. He's coming too. Bell, no more fucking around. What did Perseus say? Where is he? What you're going through now is nothing compared to what you'll experience if you don't start cooperating. We gave you a second chance when you were shit out of luck. Now, we just want some assistance in return. You worked for Perseus, Bell. I know it's hard to believe, but Arash Kadavar 86 you at that airfield in Turkey. When the plane leaves trap zone, he's stopping in Duga. This you know. Here's what you don't know. Perseus won't be there. None of these hired guns are going to leave Duba alive. We'll dump their bodies in the forest. Then we will move the weapons to Volkov in Berlin. From there, we fly to Solovetsky. But I have other plans for you. Perseus thinks too highly of you. I don't want the competition. <laughs> We were there. We found you after everything went down. The CIA reinvented you, Bell. We needed to give you a new identity to replace the old. Sims and I both wanted you to be CIA. You didn't resist it as much as we thought you might. And we were able to utilize your language and cryptography skills as an added bonus. The bigger challenge was your memory. You were a guinea pig for the CIA's MK Ultra program. They used me and Adler's missions in Vietnam to create new memories. Nothing brings people together like wartime. Instant family. Brothers in arms. Are your hands clean, Bell? No. Count yourself lucky. You've only had those memories for a few months. Me? I've been living with them for over a decade. Interrogation didn't work with you, but thanks to MK Ultra's research, we had a backup plan. If you believed you were someone else, we could lead you to a place where you'd give everything up. Enough to get us where we are today, but we're not finished yet. We have a job to do. Bell, we've got Come a on, job. Bell. We've got a job. Come on. You've got a job to do. You've got a job to do.
The trigger phrase kept you in line, but it didn't get us everything we needed. Your innermost secrets were always locked behind a door. Bell, I realize you probably hate us right now, what we've done to you. I just need you to fully understand the stakes here. What you do right now is not about me, it's not about you, it's about millions of other fucking people. It's about stopping someone who, in the end, has no true allegiance to anyone other than himself. So tell me, where is Perseus? Once we control the Green Universal, we will detonate them all for the safety of Solovetsky. For the safety of Solovetsky. 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 This is your chance to define who you really are, Bell. Where is Perseus? From the safety of Solovetsky. 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 Sims, get Washington on the line. Everyone else gear up. We're leaving now. You made the right choice, Bell. Come on. You're still one of us. Perseus. The CIA's analysts consider him to be the single largest threat to the free world. You've been given an important task. Protecting our very way of life from a great evil. The United States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. We are hours away from Perseus detonating nuclear bombs in every major European city. We'll do whatever it takes. Some of us have crossed the line to make sure the line's still there in the morning. No one's gonna brand us heroes or villains. They don't know us. As for me, I've been chasing this ghost for 13 years. That ends now.
the west wing. We're on it, Adler. Adler, this is Hudson. Have you cleared the AA guns? We need to launch these bombers. We got one AA cleared. You know that's not good enough. I can't risk an early strike. We only got one shot at this. You don't think I know that? Just be ready to launch when I tell you, Hudson. Contact!
Coordinates confirmed. One minute to bomb strike. They did it, Mr. President. They stopped the nukes. Thank God. And the CIA. Did they get Perseus? No, sir. His whereabouts are unknown. And a Russian response? Nothing yet. We're seeing signs of confusion. It's possible this was all a rogue operation. Perseus may not have been following orders from Moscow. Well, I'll be damned. Maybe we have something in common after all. Take my hand, Bill. We did it. This is a message to Perseus and those that'll follow him. We don't just sit back and hope for the best. We'll make the best happen. This is how wars are won, Bill. Do you have an update on Kasim Javadi? Yeah. With both he and Arash Kadavar dead, their terrorist network collapsed as surviving members fought for control. With no clear leadership in place, it appears the Soviets have decided to cut ties and clean up the mess. Approximately 72 hours ago, the militant's primary encampment was burned to the ground. Nothing but ashes. Apparently the few survivors that escaped have scattered and gone into hiding. What about Anton Volkov? Volkov has become a prime source of information since his capture. After interrogating him, MI6 quickly established a series of listening posts in East Berlin. They've already intercepted messages from the KGB to assets throughout the city. We're poking holes in the Iron Curtain. How did the cleanup in Havana go? We were able to recover the remains of Agents Azale and Park from the compound in Cuba. Their caskets are in transit to Tel Aviv and London, respectively. President Reagan personally reached out to their families. We spoke in the MI6. They're understandably displeased. We owe them one. What about the rest of the team? They got off Solovetsky before the Soviets could send in forces to investigate. We'll take some time to heal up, then it's back to work. We may have stopped Perseus, but his rats are still nesting all around us, thanks to the help of one of our own. True. We failed to hunt down Robert Aldrich and his domestic network of spies. We may have to go to more extreme measures, like broad domestic surveillance. Which, of course, we're not authorized to do. Not yet. What about Europe? We may have saved it from getting blown to Kingdom Come, but it's still stacked with Perseus's agents. There is more we could have done there if we'd had the time. And Bell. Arctic air. Clears the head, doesn't it? Bell, you made two extraordinary sacrifices to stop Perseus. 
One was without your knowledge. The other, you made that decision at your own accord. I just want you to know that this little thing that's happened with you and me. It was always for the greater good. You're a goddamn hero, you know that kid. Heroes have to make sacrifices. That's why when I ask you for one more, I hope you understand. It was never personal. 